Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to do a get unready with me. I haven't done one of these and they look so fun. I love watching them. I'm a huge skincare junkie, always trying out new products. So I thought this would be super fun. If you guys are new to my channel, my name is Alex. Please subscribe, I make new videos all the time. So I start by putting my hair up, taking all my jewelry off. That was my Fitbit. Always try to get that fitness in. And of course, don't forget to wash your hands before you start. You wanna have some clean hands before you touch your face. And I keep all my skincare in that little blue bag. Taking off my little eyelashes here. For the past month or two, I've been using the Bare Minerals Oil Obsessed Total Cleansing Oil, and I am obsessed. It's really lightweight. It takes your makeup off so easily. So I apply it on the dry skin, and it just kind of is like an oil, you know, and you rub it all around. It takes all your makeup off, all your eye makeup, lips, all that. It takes it all off. I love it. Okay, and then once you look like a total raccoon, you can rinse it all off. And you can use this as a cleanser, but I don't know, I just don't. I like to use a separate cleanser. So I just use this to remove my makeup. I'm just going back here and doing a little bit more on my neck and around my eyes where I kind of had a little bit extra. But on days where I don't wear makeup, I don't use this. I'll just use my cleanser. So I pat my face dry. I always like to put my cleansers on dry skin. I don't know why, I just feel like it works better that way. So I'm gonna go in with my new favorite. It's from Revision, and you can get this at Premier Look. It's called the Brightening Facial Wash. I'm obsessed with glycolic acid in my face washes because it really exfoliates and gives me like fresh new skin. But I found this one recently, and it's salicylic acid, and I love it because it exfoliates, gives me that fresh glow, but it also helps with acne, pimples, pores, all of that. So it keeps my skin really clear and really glowy and fresh, so I love this. And the bottle's really cool too. So I like to rinse that off and sometimes I'll get a towel and get that kind of wet and really go over everything. I do not want to have like one spot of makeup left over. That's my main thing at night obviously is getting all my makeup off and getting my skin really clean. And then my last step for kind of the cleaning process is toner. I love the Obagi New Derm Toner. It's just very gentle, very lightweight. It's just kind of like great for all skin types. It's just easy and it's kind of like cooling and refreshing. So I put that on all over. So a toner is great for balancing your pH and also cleaning out your pores and getting rid of any extra stuff that might have been on your face after you cleansed it. So about three to four times a week, I like to do a face mask. Right now, I've been obsessed with the five-in-one bouncy mask from First Aid Beauty. This is awesome. If you only get one thing from this video, you guys need this mask. So if you watch my daily vlog channel, I'll leave a link for it below. I go get these Hydra facials done like all the time, like once a month. This mask really gives you the same effects of a facial. It's like a facial in a jar. It nourishes, calms, plumps, firms, clears your skin, makes it even and glowy. It's awesome and I love it. So I put this on and I leave it on for anywhere between like 10, 15 minutes, sometimes like an hour. It's very gentle so you can leave it on for a long time. I love it. And then I apply this stuff from Tarte right before I wash the mask off. It's like, it looks like a lip balm, but it's not. It's an exfoliator. So you put it on and it has these little like sugar granules in there. And then you kind of rub your lips together and it gets all the dead skin off. So you just have this like plump, glowy skin when you're done. It's just really nice and pretty. So then I wipe it all off with a wet washcloth. If I wasn't doing a mask, I would skip right to this next step, which is applying my serum. Lately, I've been using this one from Caudalie. It's very hydrating, but very lightweight. So I think it would be good for all skin types. It just like melts right into your skin and it doesn't feel heavy or anything like that. So it's just really nice kind of cooling and refreshing for all skin types. But I have really dry skin. I don't know what it is, but right now it's extremely dry and patchy. So I've been loving this oil from Skin. It's like camelina oil or something. I don't know what it is, but it smells like a funnel cake and I love it. And it gives your skin so much hydration and moisture. So if you have really dry skin like I do, you guys need this oil. I apply it all over my hands, my arms, my neck, my chest, my face. It's just awesome. I like just drench myself in it and it gives my skin so much moisture. And then my last step is my Olay eye cream. This is what I use morning and night under my eyes.
So the last step, I'll just put a little lip balm on from Chapstick. But I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Getting ready for bed and doing my skincare routine is so calming and it's like one of my favorite things to do. So I'm sure it's one of your guys' favorite things to do too. So give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Please subscribe if you're new. And thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in a few days. Bye.